Well, here we go. It's the uh, last leg of Kenny Osabaki. Well, maybe I do another one, but uh, this is the last leg for today. And I'm going to start off where we sort of left off last time, Pearly Grey or Pearl Gris, and the Italian corner, which was right down the corner there, which is now here. So we've got the Italian corner and uh, where the albatross used to be. So that's quite good. Let's go and have a look at the rest. So this is the, uh, the corner, and we can have a look over the street. This is a nice plaza, and you have playgrounds for kids. Also people come here to just chill out and watch nothing. So, pearly grey in the background there, and over there is La Gomera, El Hierro. <clears throat> and you won't believe this, but if you look to the left of El Hierro, you're looking at Florida. A little bit further down, you've got Mexico, and you've got South America. And if you look all the way down there, there's not a lot till Antarctica. So that's quite good. So we're gonna go back across the road now, and down towards the beach. This is one of the oldest uh, restaurants in the village, Casa Maria. It's Wednesday today and it's closed. I've never seen this closed before. Maybe it's every Wednesday, I just don't get down here, maybe, I don't know. But uh, nice pizza place, do a lot of fish, a lot of other stuff. Tigaya, Pizanada is also closed. I don't know what happened, maybe it's holiday. <laughs> We got a new Belgian bar, Cebo, or Siabo. And we got Shangri-La, which is one of the uh, one of the famous restaurants in town. International cuisine. And then a little bit more down towards La Romantica. Hola, ¿qué tal? Busca el tesoro. So, cámara 360. And now we got uh, little Germany. Or oh, Deutschland Pequeño. Hi. And the Irish bar, the uh, Paddy McGinty's. Now here's a place called La Pina, which has changed hands about three times since I've been here. And the Mad Hatter, which is a karaoke bar. And that brings us down to the Atlantic holiday. A lot of Danish people stay here. Uh, vibes, good tappers. Monday to Saturday, one till 22. I don't know why everybody's closed today. El Ancla. This is uh, also a decent seafood restaurant. And down the bottom there, El Delfin, the dolphin. You gotta go down the steps and you're looking straight out to sea. So we'll see. And now we've got the beach. What do you think of that? In fact, you can see our house from here. If you look up towards the, uh, 
buildings over there, just past the spare ground. You see the sort of reddish and sand buildings. Well, those three at the front are three on the opposite corner where we live. So if you look above them, you'll see a sand colored one right at the top with uh, half a blind down and a, a little bit of a green blind. And that's our balcony, so when we're showing up there, we're looking straight down towards the Atlantic Holiday Company and right down here. And we can see the rocks which are right out there. Those are the rocks we can see from, uh, from our balcony. I'm not going down to the beach because the beach bar's closed for a long time, uh, maybe over a year now. And they've actually dismantled the whole bar and it's just a kiosk on the top, but nobody's opened it yet. So they've taken all the beds as well uh, because they didn't belong to the council. They belonged to the guy who had it before. And uh, so when that opens, I'll do a full review of that one. So now I'm going for a beer. This is Tim for Living With MS in Tenerife, signing off. Bye.